Hello YouTube, um, this video is going to be about programming some more CVs for the uh, model trains here. So what you're going to need is first a DCC system and a locomotive with a DCC decoder installed and obviously a track, um, but uh, then you can get to it. So the uh, locomotive I have here is an Atlas-840 CW. Um, Santa Fe war bonnet uh, number 838 and the decoder I have in it is a DH 123P and uh, I already put installed it and I got it programmed on the proper address so I'll plug in 838 here and uh, I'll show you guys that's going that way and that's that way and you see the lights going there too so uh, let's get to it so let's see, first off, I have Digitrack Zephyr and the 123P. So I already did some videos on programming uh, sounds, and this time I'm going to go over um, acceleration and deceleration of the locomotive, which it. Um, don't know that it goes over in this instruction manual, however you can look online or you can take um, I'll just use the one with the 143 and that has the uh, information on adjusting the CV values for speed um, right here momentum and personally I don't like when the engine starts instantly and stops instantly and I'll show you what I mean here I'll put the throttle on three and keep it on brake and then move it forward and I'll show you how quick this thing takes off. And then it's off. And back. It's pretty quick and it you know, it stops very, you know, on a dime sort of. And I don't really like that. So um I'm going to change that. So you look in here and it'll show you momentum. CV3 is the um, acceleration and CV4 is deceleration. And both are fed at, set at zero. And um, it ranges all the way from that to uh, 31. So we will uh, try that. So, let's see, where, right now, I guess it's at zero. So let's change the acceleration to uh, 15. So what I'll do over here is just change the CV. So um, program to ops mode and press CV. And this is zero, 03. Press CV again, 1, 5. And then press CV right. Track power off, track power back on. And, uh... So, um, usually turning the track power off works, but uh, this time I'll just take it off the track and um, see what we get here. So go to locomotive 838, and that uh, starts get going really slow there. Still slows um slows down very quick because that is CV4 which I have not changed yet. But uh, bring some cars back here. Show you what it's like. So um here we got. We'll put it on brake and full throttle. And when you hear the click in the video, that will indicate that it is now moving forward. Um, that was just setting the lights. So now it's on full throttle, and I'll move it to the forward position, and we'll see how quick it gets going here. So uh, right now. So 
so as you can see it uh, took a pretty good amount of time till it got moving here and it's still picking up speed and I'd say about now it's at full speed deceleration rate it has not been changed yet so I'll put brake on now and it'll stop very quick and then we'll move the throttle back to zero so let's try changing the slowdown variable so program and still in ops mode and the deceleration is CV4 so uh, press CV04 CV again and now we'll change the variable to 015 just like the other one press the program button and press exit turn the track power off track power back on and uh, make my SD70 AC shut up over there so now the CV values for the acceleration and deceleration are both on um, 15 Speed. Start moving here. And it's taking a while to get moving there. And now I will press the brake button right about now and it's still moving and there we go now it stops so that is adjusting the momentum on a locomotive and let's move the throttle back down to zero when we're done so uh Hopefully you guys learned something in this video about um, changing the momentum of a locomotive. Uh, my next two videos will be about changing the starting um, CV and the high speed CV. And then somewhere in around there, there will also be a layout update. Um, so, yeah, thanks for watching. And remember, this was in ops mode, which you need to know the address of the locomotive. In this case, it was 838. And then you just press program to ops mode, press the CV button enter the CV you want to change, press CV again, enter the, um, the number that the, you want to change the CV value to, I guess that's the word, enter the value, and then press CVWR for CV right, and press exit, turn the track power off, or take the locomotive off the track. Basically, you just want to reset the decoder, and um, that'll do it. So, thank you for watching, um, and look for more videos in the future.